Hi everyone and welcome to The Wild Walk, a new series on this channel where I take you along as a point of view camera while doing wildlife photography. Today I am in the new location and I've given myself one hour to find as many wild animals as I can. From now on I will talk much quieter so I hope you can still hear me because uh, I will try to sneak up on the animals and not scare them. Just quickly on the gear, I am bringing the Sigma 150-600 to together with my Nikon D500. That's it, just this setup, one camera, one lens and enjoying the nature. Ok, let's go. I can hear the woodpecker on my right. I will try to locate it and uh, get closer. Now I better prepare my equipment. I don't want to miss the moment when I get the opportunity. Right now I am at one one thousandth of a second at 6.3 aperture. I'm shooting on a auto ISO and that's it. Again. Always when I'm approaching the bird, I never walk straight to it. I always go like zigzag, zigzag, because the bird doesn't feel like it's in danger and it lets you get much closer before it flies away. finally here and nature is waking up uh, all the leaves growing back on the trees on the foliage it's so beautiful
think the frame of that trail camera can. You can see that large area of forests over there. That's the closest to where I live, where there are bears living. So it's it's their territory. And uh, that's also an idea for some future projects. Uh, because I would like to further explore this that forest and uh, look for bears. Yep, all of that over there. I'm really enjoying the simplicity of today's uh, photography trip. Okay, nothing here. I approached this part slowly because uh, if something was standing there, maybe eating, uh, I would get a chance to photograph it. So yeah, I was saying that it's so nice to be just outside, one lens, one camera, no, uh, no video recording, no microphones, no tripods, no heavy equipment, just me, the nature, and this is simple gear. should just uh, walk back from where I came uh, as not to scare him away but I waited long enough and uh, he decided to uh, to move away so now I can continue in this direction without uh, scaring him
right guys that was crazy I just spoke with the person <laughs> who set the trail camera there <laughs> he actually saw me on the camera and he came here to check out if I'm going to steal it or just walk past it and do my photography we chatted a bit he showed me some pictures from the from the trail camera and there was a jackal as well as uh, the pine martins and he said that there's also the white boar um, very common in this area and they even saw bears come all the way here so now I know that this location is very promising I just need to come here more often and um, explore it further now it's around sunset so I'm losing the light pretty quickly but uh, for one day I'm already happy with what I've got okay crossing the the river again I'll try not to fall in such a cool location cuckoo just look at all these clouds That's good.